up, you guys? How y'all doing, man? Aquí estamos de regreso after a very, very, Bruh. very, very long time. I know you guys, you know, haven't seen us in probably what, in like three to four months, más o menos. Yeah, you guys, it's but been a back. while. But we're back. Before we get started with the video, like always, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, turn on your post notifications, follow us on TikTok and Instagram because we do post videos daily. Also, we would say go check out Raza Distinta, but that's a different topic for today, you guys. We have so much to tell you guys, as you can tell by the title of this video. We are just going to be talking about everything that's been going on in our lives and why we have been so absent from YouTube and Raza Distinta and everything that's been happening, pretty much. I mean, I feel like there's just so much to talk about, right? But I think just to start it off with, you know, as far as YouTube goes, since we're here, just right to, to talk about YouTube first. It's like we took a little pause, a little break, I think, because we just have so much going on in our lives. And I think we were getting really overwhelmed. We had a lot on our plates. We were trying to balance out so many things, you know, from YouTube, Instagram, TikTok, the rest of these things, our personal lives, family, all of this stuff, relationship, you know. And uh, I think one of the things we decided to kind of put a pause on was, was YouTube. Um, and yeah, so that's kind of the reason why, you know, maybe we'll get a little bit more into detail what happened and the things that we kind of went through and everything but mainly just that it was just a lot of stuff we were trying to balance at the same time and it just wasn't working out but you guys we are back on youtube we have already filmed like three two or three videos that we want to post but we haven't posted them yet because we want to post this one first to kind of just update you guys everything yeah. with everything that's been going on but get ready because we do have those videos lined up for you guys we got two vlogs yeah, we got two vlogs already lined up, as Grandma said. On one of the vlogs, we actually changed it up a little bit because, again, you know, it's a new time for YouTube, and we got a cameraman for one of the videos, and so it's a little, it's gonna be a little different from what you guys are used to, right, from the vlogs, and we really enjoyed it. Yeah. So hopefully, you know, we can continue to bring out that type of style of video, you know, as to where we're just kind of going about our our day, doing our thing, and then we got somebody following us, and it just made it a lot easier for us, and yeah, so. You guys, I feel like the reason we kind of dropped YouTube and Rosa Distinta, I feel like we never really talked about it. We kind of just disappeared. But the reason that we dropped it was because we got really overwhelmed with everything that was happening. We got so many opportunities and it was just a lot of traveling. And then the relationship that Tony and I had wasn't really, it wasn't healthy. And so we started going to therapy and we just became really overwhelmed with all of the changes happening in our life. And so we kind of prioritized TikTok and Instagram and decided to go with that. But now we're back on YouTube because we're happy and we're healthy. The process being kind of like up and down, you know, with our personal relationship. Um, obviously, we had changes to our like social media presence, right? And a lot of people during the time that we were actually figuring things out, getting better, figuring out what, what made us happy individually and what made us happy together as a couple. On social media, everybody thought that we were like about to break up. Everybody thought we were mad, that we didn't want to be with each other, that I was cheating, that Grandma was cheating. And it was just like crazy stuff, you guys. Like, se pasaban en veces, you know, but we just kind of kept rocking with it. And um, I mean, I'm not, I don't think it could have been any different. You know, I'm happy with how we are right now. And there's still things that we're going to continue to work on off camera too, you know, because at the end of the day, we're, we're regular people, you know. we we just show a little bit of our lives to to the camera, you know, but yeah. it was just a lot, a lot of stuff going on. And but yeah, thankfully, you know, I can say that me and Kramo's relationship is way healthier. And um, yeah, I don't know what, what, what you got anything to add to that. Yeah, and, I think it was just because you guys were so used to seeing us together all of the time. Like if we weren't together, then something was wrong. But I think that changed after we started going to therapy because we are so codependent on each other like we had to be together all the time but now we're like we're taking time to kind of just be with ourselves and enjoy being alone but also enjoy the time that we have being in the relationship so yeah. pretty heavily i would say towards the beginning of the year for myself you know i started doing that a lot i started making a lot of soccer content i then ended up getting injured and that was a whole nother thing too and then um, Karima on her and she was getting a lot of opportunities for herself which you know at the time as you say we're very codependent it was very difficult I think for, for me to comprehend at times and for her to feel like she could go do this off 
by herself without having to like take me with her or having to feel like we're gonna get an argument or whatever it was you know so it was just a lot of time to work on ourselves and figure out what made us happy first because I think ever since we started this we were always together doing everything together so we never really got the opportunity to to figure ourselves out I guess individually you know with that being said you guys we do have some amazing plans for youtube and Rosa Distinta. like we said we're gonna start vlogging more often we are gonna try to get um our cameraman to come out with us when we do go to like activities or events just to make it a little easier on us so we're not super overwhelmed um what else also, I think, I don't know how we're going to do it for YouTube, but like we said, we are going to make kind of videos like this. We're going to make videos like podcast style. We don't necessarily want it to be a podcast, but we just want to talk about everything that's going on in our lives, everything that has happened to us, all of our story times, all of the cheese made you guys. We're going to keep you guys updated. Yeah, yeah. And so just stay tuned for that because we're really excited. Yeah, and then with like this new little segment, you know, if you guys can help us out with the name too, that would be... And we want to come up with a little cool name, you know? Yeah. Um, it's not going to be a whole separate YouTube channel where we're going to do this. We're going to continue doing it on this one. So, like Prima said, it's not going to be a like a whole different podcast. It's not, not like that. It'll just be like random little like videos that come up whenever yeah. we have something to do. Yeah, because we're yeah, yeah. Me and Prima are like talking a lot. So, you know, we're just going to sit back maybe like once a week. I would say hopefully that's the, that's the goal to do once a week and... Um, also have you guys kind of in the in the loop of everything you know we'll probably be posting a uh, little like questionnaires on our instagrams and then whatever that question is for that week you know you guys can give us your responses your story times any questions that you guys might have and then we'll sit down and, and just talk about it whether it's cheese or whether it's something more serious that you guys want to know about you know initially we were going to call this little like segment we we're going to call it car talks but as you guys can tell we are not in a car um, we had tried to film this video like three times already, you guys, and every time there's just so many problems with the microphone. So we went out and we got new mics. Some lights, some lights. Um, and we also like we're still figuring out how to like do everything because obviously this is new to us and we want everything to be good. But we do want a little like title or a name for our segment, so it can't be car talks because we're not in a freaking car. You know, we'll probably make like a little playlist of all of these. I don't know. We'll see. Yapping, yapping with Karima and Tony. I don't like that word. We're not going to use that. You know, like yapping? No, I don't like that word. Why? It's, it's like, I don't know. Yappers. Like, I'm a yapper. Like, I don't know. It's just kind of annoying to me. Wow. So what time been saying that you've been annoyed or what? Well, no. But like, I, I would never say it. Stupid. Oh, my God. Uh, you, want to, you want me to freaking go bald? Yes. Like I yeah, would never, yes, 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 okay, but, um, anything without the word yap, okay, I just don't like that word. Chatting it. Huh? Chatting it. Chatting it. Chatting it. I have no idea what he's saying, I think he's having a stroke, guys. Chatting it. Chatting it. Like, you see how, y'all see how Karama's sitting, like, with her leg like that, like, I know that, like, girls sit like that, during like, the leg. Like, Podcast, like, I can't do that shit, you know. But it's because I'm flexible and I actually stretch. Uh, like, I'm, like, I'm struggling to figure out how I want to hold the microphone, you guys. Like, I feel like this is like, it's just kind of awkward at times. I get a little tired, and then this is like, my bag is tired, so I'm like trying to figure out what's the best way. You know? Oh, also, let's talk about Rasa Distinta. I feel like we haven't talked about Rasa Distinta, you guys. We kind of. Yeah, we just kind of took a pause yeah. on that. Um, it was the same thing as YouTube, you know, just felt like it was a lot going on, a lot of. Things going on after Rasa Distinta, like the whole behind the, like the behind the scenes pretty much, the whole process before like a launch, it's, I would say it's pretty... It's really overwhelming, Yeah, actually. it's overwhelming, especially because me and Prime will do everything just by ourselves. It's only us two, you know? Um, and so I think we kind of messed up that way, you know, maybe not trying to seek help elsewhere too, or like more support. And I think that's maybe why we also got really overwhelmed. We are looking for a digital designer because we have ideas, we just don't know how to bring them to life, you guys. Like, we don't know how to draw, like, we're not artistic like that. So we are looking for a digital designer to kind of help us out. Um, so if you know any, or you are one, let us know. Text us, comment. Um, but, yeah, it was really overwhelming because we were doing all of the designs. We were going to the shop and getting everything, like, well, obviously we weren't printing them ourselves, but, like, 
we were folding the shirts, packaging them, sending the packages out. Like it became a lot. And then on top of that, we had to edit YouTube videos and film the videos and then do brand deals for like TikTok and Instagram. And like, I don't say this to come off like ungrateful. Like I'm so thankful for everything that we have. And I'm so thankful to be in the position that we are in now. Like, and it's all thanks to you guys. But it was like, we didn't know how to manage any of it. But here we are. At the end of the day, you know, it's like, Again, just because we're on the social media, you know, you guys see a little glimpse of our lives, but there's so much more to it, you know, so we do get tired, we do get in arguments, we do get overwhelmed, we do have family problems, we do have this, we do have, like, like anybody else, right? So, kind of what she was saying, you know, none of this is us being ungrateful about the opportunities that we have gotten, but it's just more so, of like, us trying to make sure that we're healthy, physically, mentally, emotionally, because if we're not, then everything's just gonna be half-assed or everything's just gonna be fake. Everything's yeah. gonna, it's just not gonna flow. It's not gonna be generic. It's not gonna be real, you know? So I think taking that step back in these certain areas of our career, what was, it was what was gonna get us back to the position that we wanted to be in, if that makes sense. Yeah, I mean, if you guys don't follow us on TikTok or Instagram, I mean, I don't know what y'all doing, but I felt like too we hadn't made a video or anything like that explaining what was going on because I don't think we took like a complete pause off social media, you know. We were still posting on TikTok, we were still posting on Instagram. So I think I would say I'm guessing the majority of the people that follow us or are subscribed to us here on YouTube follow us on Instagram or TikTok. So you guys are kinda like staying up to date muscle manuals with what we were doing. But if you guys don't follow us over there and you guys want to see more content from us, make sure you guys do that because we do post videos daily over there and uh sometimes we'll do story times over there we'll do vlogs you know we'll do things that are more at reach because like, we record with our phone rather than with the camera for like, youtube you know so sometimes it is a little more accessible to make certain content in certain places if there is any type of videos that you guys would like to see from us let, like, us, let us know let us know shoot us dms comment on here whatever it is you know if you guys want to just, just reach out to us you see if you come across a message well no, you see no, but keep spamming us and we'll eventually come across it here. But it's you know, muchas gracias to everybody that's that's still here, to you that's watching right now, thank you for for continuing to show us love and support after that long period of time. But that is it for today's video. Like always don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, turn on post notifications, follow us on TikTok and Instagram because we do post videos daily. Hey. We love you guys so much and we are so thankful that you guys are all still here supporting us and everything that we do. You guys are amazing and I love each and every single one of you guys. Yes. We love y'all and, and we want you guys to, you know, like um like like <laughs> We love you guys. You guys have a beautiful day, beautiful evening, afternoon, beautiful night. Yeah, I know that one. We'll see you guys in the next video. Bye. Oh.